हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम अगेन एंड दिस इज माय न्यू प्रोजेक्ट ह्यूमन रिसोर्स मैनेजमेंट सिस्टम एंड आई हैव डेवलप्ड दिस प्रोजेक्ट इन जावा जीएसपी एंड मायस्कल द वर्जन फॉर द जेटकी आई एम यूजिंग इज द जेटकी 1.8 एंड द टॉमकेट वर्जन इज 7 बिकॉज़ आई एम रनिंग दिस प्रोजेक्ट ऑन द टॉमकेट इट्स अ वेब एप्लीकेशन सो टॉमकेट वर्जन इज 7 बट इफ यू हैव द लेटेस्ट टॉमकेट वर्जन लाइक टॉमकेट 8 और टॉमकेट 9 देन यू कैन आल्सो यूज दैट वर्जन टू रन दिस प्रोजेक्ट राइट for mysql i am using the mysql 5.6 for connecting the mysql with uh, java and jsp i am using the mysql j connector which you will get easily from the mysql.org website right so also i am not using any type of id for running this project i am running this project directly on the tomcat server but if you have netbeans or eclipse then you can easily configure and run this project on the netbeans and eclipse id right so this this is all about the server technologies right for front end because it's a web application so i am using the html css and javascript some of the jquery library also have used like uh, form validations date of uh, calendar integrations and the creating drop down menus i have used the jquery plugins right so jquery plugins jquery is the javascript library right so we you can e use for giving some good effects adding components inside your web application right so this all technologies i have used for developing this project human resource management system so let's start with the functionality go through so as i told you earlier the project title is human resource management system it's a java jsp mysql based web based mini dbms project right it's a web based mini dbms project mini because it contains a very limited functionality that limited functionality is it has only and only admin login where admin can log in and admin can perform certain operations there is no login for the customers there is no login for the users or other of other users level right so it has only and only admin login that's why it's a mini project okay so let's start with the functionality go through so this is the home page of the project you can see this is a simple home page and if you want to change the content of the home page then you can change it directly from the html a jsp page this is about right and it's about the project and if you want to change the content of this about then you can change it directly from the html this is admin login and this uh, details are checking from the database right and if you don't have the user id and password then you will not be able to log in this is a contact us and it's also a static page and i'm not saving the value of this contact us page anywhere into the database and uh, even i am not sending any type of email and sms from this page right so let me log in so the user id is admin and the password is test once you log in inside the system then you will get the dashboard so these operations only admin can perform right so this is the add employee F sorry add employee from where admin will be able to add the employee so these fields you need to enter and these fields will be saved into the database right one more thing i want to show you this are the drop downs and these drop downs are containing the value from the database all the drop downs are dynamic right and if you want to change the value of this drop downs then you can update it from the database into the from the php my admin or the mysql any type of using any type of mysql gui tool right this is a add employee from where you will be able to add the employees and those employees will be saved into the database this is the add salary from where you will be able to add the salary of the employee so it contains this drop down will contain all of the employees which you have added into the database this is the month and this is a year right so from where you will be able to select the employee details and an amount paid and you can save the salary and these details will be saved into the mysql database right this is the employee report from where you will be able to uh, see the report of the employee right so this these employees we have added and if you want to see the salary how much salary we have paid then you can select this view salary from the drop down and you will be able to see the salary of that employee right even you can edit it also right so one more thing i want to show you is employee report from here you will be able to edit the employee also right and those after editing it you can update the records right this is the contact us page which i already uh, explained to you this is a logout functionality once you log out from the system then all of the admin session will be destroyed and none of the internal admin pages will be accessed right so let me show you once you log out then you can see 
the above admin menu is not displaying right means add employee per salary is not displaying but if you log inside the system it's displaying right but if you log out then it will be hidden right so this header is totally session driven and it's uh, render the menu according to the session level right so these all functionalities i have developed this in this project human resource management system and uh, as i told you earlier this is a java jsp mysql mini web based dbms project right but if you need more functionality in this project just put it into the comment i will incorporate those changes i will make this project more better and better according to your requirements and don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest project videos on the latest technologies thanks for watching the video thank you very much